If you've enjoyed this video, please like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for notifications on new videos. Let's, Let's go. go! Hello, Number Block fans. In today's video, we're going to do all about counting from one to ten, and we're going to create the Number Block hands and have help from our Number Block Mathlink cubes, toys, and Number Blobs. So, for the first part of the video, we're going to create the number block hands. So first you will need two wooden pair of hands, the right and the left. Here we have two pair of hands and the fingers are flexible so you can pull them down or pull them up or put them in any position you'd like. So first we'll start with the left hand to do one to five. So on the left hand, first finger we need to paint is the thumb. This is to represent number one and number one is red. So we're going to paint the entire thumb red. And there is our finished finger or thumb for number one. Next we have the forefinger. So it is the next one along from the thumb. We're going to paint this finger orange as this forefinger will represent the number two, with number one and two being held up. So we'll paint the entire finger orange. So the next finger is the middle finger, and this will represent number three. So we need to paint this finger yellow. And you can see the first three fingers that are up now are red, orange and yellow which represent one, two, and three. Next we have the fourth or the ring finger and we're going to paint this finger green. This finger is going to represent number block four. As you can see there are four fingers up and this last finger is now green. And last but not least for the left hand we have the last finger or the fifth finger or the little or pinky finger. So there are five fingers up, so the colour we're going to paint this finger is blue. And this will represent number block five. Can you see now? Five fingers up, it's a high five. So now we've completed the left hand, we need to go on and finish the right hand. As we've done one to five, now we need to do numbers 6 to 10. So next we're on the 6th finger and it's the pinky finger again on this one because we need to do them opposite. So when we hold them out on the palms it will flow from 1 to 10. So we're going to paint this one a deep purple or an indigo to represent number block 6 or number 6. So next we have the 7th finger to do and this is the ring finger on the right hand. So for number seven or the seventh finger, you can either do the whole finger violet or you can paint it like number block seven as a rainbow. So I'm going to use red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo and violet as number block seven represents the rainbow. Next we have the middle finger on the right hand and this is going to represent number block 8. So we need to paint the middle finger a pink. And the ninth finger is the forefinger on the right hand. So we're going to paint this in the colours of number block 9. So we need to paint the bottom third a dark grey, the middle a light grey and then the top an even lighter grey than the one before. So it's three shades of grey going from dark to lightest to represent number block nine. And last but not least we have the last and tenth finger which is the thumb on the right hand. We're going to paint this all white to represent number block 
10. Then we will do some details for number block 10. However, we need to let them dry first. And here is the result of our painted hands. And then last but not least for number block 10, we're going to do the red outline or trim around the thumb. You can either paint this on, or I'm using a red marker pen to draw a strip around the edges of the thumb. And I'm going to do this all the way around. And here we have our finished number block hands, one to 10. So first, let's test our hands and count from one to 10. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten fingers. Now, let's have some help from our number block action figures. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That was excellent! Double high five! Let's try that again from 10 to 1 with the number block MathLink cubes. So let's count backwards with the MathLink cubes. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, one. So the next thing we're going to do is just keep adding one up to ten. So here is one plus another one equals two. Two plus another one equals three. Three plus another one equals Four. Four plus another one equals five. Five plus another one equals six. Six plus another one equals seven. Seven plus another one equals eight. 8 plus another one equals 9 and 9 plus another one equals 10 and lastly we're going to count from 1 to 10 with the number blobs so first we'll start with 1 and 1 number blob then we have 2 1 two number blobs. Then we have three. One, two, three number blobs. Then we have four. One, two, three, four number blobs. Then we have five. One, two, three, four, five. Five number blobs. Then we have six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six normal blobs. Next is seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven normal blobs. Next is eight. One, Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight number blobs. Next is number nine. 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine number blobs. And the last finger and number is ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten number blobs. And here are all the number blobs from one to ten with the number block hands. And that was the end of today's video. We hope you enjoyed playing and learning all about the numbers from 1 to 10 with the number blocks. Hope to see you again next time. Bye bye! Hello! If you enjoyed today's video, please like, subscribe and click the bell icon for notifications on new videos. Bye bye!